We continue talking about our first Wild Preps Athlete of the Week for the winter sports season. It's brought to you by our great friends at Blue Cross Blue Shield of Wyoming. I'm joined by Allie Wheeler from Natrona County High School, who got off to an absolutely dominant start last weekend. Was it weird that you were supposed to go to Laramie and then ended up having to shift gears and go to Lander? I know it wasn't necessarily last minute, but was it a little bit strange uh, adjusting courses right before the, the start of the season, Allie? No, this has happened in the past before, and I like Lander more than Laramie, so I oh. was glad that it switched. <laughs> well, yeah, I would say so based upon your performances. How do you think you did for uh, personally uh, on the opening weekend of the season? I think it was a strong start, um, definitely a starting place, and I hope to get better throughout the season. Well, you won the first race, the classic race, by uh, I think 40 seconds, a minute and a half over that in the freestyle race. Which which discipline do you prefer? Which technique do you prefer? Um, I like classic, but I like longer races. So the longer it is, the better it is for me. So like if you're you're doing like a 10K classic, you're better off with that versus a shorter like last week? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Describe to me from your vantage point where you feel you're at here starting off this 2023-24 season with, you know, just uh, your skill level, your technique, uh, where do you think you're at right now? I think I'm in a really good starting place. I trained all year round, trained about 300 hours this summer, and I'm ready for some bigger and better races. I got you. So this was a good, I guess, baseline, so to speak? Yes. Okay, so where do you feel like you need to keep improving? Definitely in the sprints. Um, when I get to bigger races, they have like little 1.5 kilometer sprint races. So that's something that I'll be working on. Okay. Take me back to last weekend. Uh, you know, take me through your race. First of all, in, in the four kilometer classic on Friday, uh, kind of map it out for me. Where, where do you feel you really excel? Where do you feel like you can improve from that race? So the course was moved to the upper meadow. So it was pretty flat. Um, it would only take about like eight to nine minutes. And I knew that it would just pretty much be a sprint. So I just went full gas the whole time and hope to not <laughs> run out. <laughs> well, what about for Saturday's freestyle? Kind of the same question. Take me through that race a little bit. So that was the same course as Friday, just two times around. So it's also pretty flat. There was only one hill. So kind of the same strategy, just sprint it out <laughs> <laughs> is it different sprinting with the two different techniques yeah yeah skate i think takes a little more energy to sprint with okay all right well great start for you um you know what do you think the competition is going to be like for high school girls nordic season here um i think it'll get better as the season goes on and i think this race was a good way to push myself do you have certain goals in mind this season? Yeah, I am going to go to senior nationals in the first week of January, and I hope to make an international team like I did last year and place at nationals in March. How different of a competition is that? You know, compare that to what you see in Wyoming versus what you're doing on a national level. It's very different. Um Last weekend, I think there was about 60 girls in the race versus at Nationals, there's like 200 to 300. And the competition is just that much closer. Like in a 10K race, it could be 0.2 seconds apart from first and second. I gotcha. Lastly, what do you love the most about cross-country skiing? I love being outside. I don't think I could do a sport that was confined in one place. I really like to be in the mountains. Okay, I got you. So this really, really just goes to your core, it sounds like. And and coming off cross country, how much does that benefit you coming into the winter sports season with cross country skiing? I think running really, really helps my aerobic base and my classic technique. I did have to work a little more on my skate transitioning from that, but I think for me, it really helps. Well, congratulations on an absolutely dominant start last weekend, Lander. Best of luck at the uh, national competition after the first of the year, and thanks for taking some time. Thank you.